Log in from your admin console and select Billings and Payments section. Under Invoice section you can manage your invoices such as creating an invoice, modify and export. Automated Fees Plan would allow you to create term plans and package plans. You can also view your plan utilization. Cash Flow would allow you to view your overall stats of the invoice. You can manage your bank account details under School Deposit section. Billing Email, Currency Type and Tax can be changed under Settings section. To get started you can select Accounts tab and select Create a Bank Account. Enter your bank details and submit. The verification process will take two to three working days. You can check your account email for more details. Now go to Invoice section tab and select Create Invoice. You can create an invoice by choosing One-Time Invoice and Recurring Plan. One-Time Invoice will be sent to user only once whereas Recurring Invoice would be will be generating invoices at regular interval. Billing interval would be monthly, bi-weekly and weekly. Invoice on would be the date at which the invoice needs to send. Due on is the due date for the invoice. Plan start date and end would be corresponding date at which the recurring invoice needs to started and ended. Enter the following details. Invoice name, description, payment instruction, reference, send remainder, Select Event Association and Online Payment Type. Enter the Item Details and Discount. Select Next. You can now choose the students whom you would like to send the invoice. You can choose your students by classroom, school or individual students here as how it's done. Proceed next. You can now overview your invoice. Select Send Invoice. Parents will now receive an invoice notification in their mobile app. Parents can select PayNow to do an online payment via Schooly. Schooly supports credit and debit cards and other services as well. To update a payment go to Invoice tab and select your invoice. Select three dots and choose Update Payments. You can choose your payment type by cash, check, bank transfer or nets. Select the payment date. You can also choose partial payment and enter the amount. Update your payment. Now let's see how automated fee plans work. Go to Automated Fee Plan tab and select Packages. Enter your plan name and choose your start date. You can also enable your expiry option. Enter your expiry by years, month, weeks or days, choose your session. You can enter your payment instruction in the text field. Choose your payment mode. Add your charges by selecting Add Charges, choose by Session or Fixed Fee. For Session enter Description, Sessions and Cost. For Fixed Fee enter the Description and Cost. Add your Discounts and Surcharge in the Discount and Surcharge section. Add your discounts and surcharge in the discount and surcharge section. You can also add your sibling discount as well. Renewal can be added by days and session. Select Create Plan. For Term Plan you can select Create Plan and choose terms from the drop-down. Enter your plan name and choose your start and end date.
Choose billing interval by monthly or weekly and invoice on by date and due on by due date. You can enter your payment instruction in the text field. Choose your payment mode. Add your charges by selecting Add Charges. For fixed fee enter the description and cost. Add your discounts and surcharge in the Discount and Surcharge section. Late fees and early bird can also be added in percentage under penalty section. You can also add your sibling discount as well. Select create plan. You can now choose the students whom you would like to send the invoice. You can choose your students by classroom, school or individual students here as how it's done. Proceed next. You can now overview your invoice. Select Send Invoice. Parents will now receive an invoice notification in their mobile app.